Hello and welcome to Reality News Roundup. Here are the top stories of the day. Union Urban Development Secretary Rajiv Gauba has asked Pune and other cities selected for Smart City Mission to ensure that it is launched by June 25, while urging the chosen smart cities to ensure appointment of full-time chief executive officers for the special purpose vehicles. Gauba said that civic bodies also have the option of appointing professionals as CEOs. With celebrities facing flack over brand endorsements, the Central Consumer Protection Council on Tuesday said celebrities should be made liable for misleading advertisements. This was stated by Consumer Affairs Minister Ram Vilas Pasman after the CCPC meeting. Pasman, who is the CCPC chairman, said the council was of the view that there should be guidelines for brand ambassadors. Indian cricket team captain MS Dhoni last week resigned as the brand ambassador of realty firm Amal Pali days after unhappy residents of a housing project in Noida launched a social media campaign asking the cricketer to disassociate himself from the builder. The Noida Authority has joined hands with two other Gautam Budnagar authorities to start a scheme that offers easier rescheduled payment plans to defaulting land allottees in order to recover dues that amount to nearly 15,000 crore rupees. The total land dues for nearly three authorities 24,000 crore rupees. Noida officials said the new scheme will run only till April 30th, under which allottees will have one chance to submit an application and accept the rescheduled payment plan. Too much money, too few deals. That's what is pushing non-banking finance companies and private equity funds to further reduce interest rates on debt deals with real estate developers. In the 18 to 24 months, interest rates for debt deals, which are mostly structured transactions, have dropped by 1 to 2 percent. The supply of debt has increased over the last two to three years as several new players, including the likes of Paramal, KKR, Altico, India Bulls Real Estate, Indostar, and others, ventured aggressively into the funding real estate projects. Thank you for watching. For latest updates, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and Instagram.